How's it going, ladies and gents? My name's Dede, I'm a tit swacker, I'm an idiot and an Iveco, the original Todge in a truck, whatever you want to call me, I will be it. Today's video, a little bit different, it's going to be going into the educational playlist on my channel, and it's going to be how to fuel up a gas guzzler, a CNG vehicle, HGV, whatever you may want to call it. Just in case you get put in one, and you don't know how to fuel it up, I'm going to show you in this video. First off though, just want to say if you want to follow me on Instagram at DD2012, feel free. If you want to add me on Facebook, Gareth DD, feel free. And if you want to join the memberships that are growing nicely, click the join button, 4 99 a month helps support the channel. Okay? So, we'll crack on with it. There's Up to now, there's only five that I know of in the UK that we can use. There's one here in Warrington, one in Leyland, one in Stoke, one at Red Lion Truck Stop, M1, Junction 16, and one at the Big Business Park, just off the M6, Junction 6. Them are the only five we can use at the moment, so we're quite, quite restricted to where we can and can't go, I would think anyway. Um, I've done about 255 miles up to now. I'll get that right. I'll calculate that exactly when we actually start fueling up and I'll give you a minute and then I'll, I'll let you know exactly how many how many miles I've done. But we are just coming into the red. So as you can see, they, they don't go as far as diesels, but they are a hell of a lot cheaper to fuel up and the more environmentally friendly, so I believe. Anyway, let's get into it. So it's a good safety feature this to be fair, it's really good. You've got a fob on your keys. Keys for the truck, you've got a fob. Yeah. And you want to park with the meter right at the side of you. Like so. We'll turn our lights off so it doesn't shout at me. We'll get out and now carry on. Right. We're going to get the mileage first. 319558. We've got to remember that. 319558. You get this little box, twist and open, and that is where you refuel it. I hope you can see. That's where we refuel. You come over to this meter, put your fob on, three, one, nine, five, five, eight, enter, and it tells you where to fuel that. get said pump have the arrow facing you like so insert on like so and twist all the way around come to here and press start jobs are good em. and it takes a while Now the good thing about this safety feature is ooh, ooh, why that little box is open the engine won't start while that box is open good safety feature so you're never going to rip your uh, your gas line off but It takes ages, and ages, and ages. And ages. <laughs> so, up to now, we've done 402 miles. 402 kilometers. What's that in miles? 402 kilometers in miles. 402. In miles, 249.8 miles, 250 miles we've done. We probably could have got maybe another 50 miles out of it. So I would say about 300 miles to a full tank of gas. Ain't best really, is it? Anyway, we we'll sit here, wait for it to fill up, which is probably going to take about 20 minutes, 
15 20 minutes needs about 100 quid but once the pressure gets so high it keeps cutting off and putting a little bit more and cutting off putting a little bit more in basically like an air pump on a car you know when you put air in your tires and it and then stops and then well it does that and it takes quite a while so i'll come back to you in a second right now when it's full right we are done and it's only cost 104 quid that 104 pound and 9p one important thing i forgot to mention right at the very beginning of the video is the green and red light as you can see on top i'm on the right hand pump this one as you can see on top it's got a green light means that it's safe to take the um the hose off if that's on red can't touch it if it's on red when you pull up to it sometimes these do have the sometimes they do have a toggle that you've got to turn so it, obviously you put it on stop it's on stop when you when you get to it you turn it press it to start when you're hooked up to it when you're finished you can just leave it off and pull it off if you want and it's pull the hose off and it's all good it'll be red when you pull up to it just turn it to stop and then it'll go green so just so you know so now i've got the hose off easy as that done go home like i say you can't go anywhere with the hose attached anyway because you can't start the ignition so let's pull it off very simple opposite of the way you put it on turn the knob all the way around and it comes off hook it back up close your little door put your flap back and then we're good to go that is it it is as simple as that now you know how to fill up your gas guzzler nice short video for you hope somebody finds it useful in the future fingers crossed that's what i'm here for to try and show you what i know thanks for watching take care click that subscribe button give it a thumbs up if you found this video useful i'll see you in the next one ciao for now